what is mind? Is it a subconscious? Is it a conscious? Or is it the awareness? I would say it's all of that and more. Human mind is a combination of many things that with this combination it forms into our individual mind and the four elements form into our physical body but today I would like to talk about the mind what it is what it does and how do we control it first like I mentioned earlier, my is the formation of several things from our five senses to our emotions, our thoughts, our memories, our consciousness, our awareness, all of that form into our individual mind and shape who we are, what we want, what we like and what we value as important to us and with these five things that I mentioned from our senses to our memory, thoughts, emotions and awareness we generally tend to act on this thing naturally without us aware of it or notice it and sometimes it even act simultaneously all together so for us to break free from our suffering we need to be free from these five things and by being free doesn't mean we have to get rid of it but rather we are not attached to it not attached to our senses such as we may still consume food, water, or listen to music, or watch a good movie, but we are not need to attach to it, then we will not suffer by it in any way. Or when it comes to have a new memory, good or bad, or have a thoughts or emotions, we can still have those like a human, but we can choose what to attach and what not to attach the lesser we attach to it the lesser suffering we will be and one of the way to increase our performance or our understanding of this thing we need to do a vipassana meditation or in other words a critical analysis of meditation where you see every little bit of detail and try to analyze it and hopefully fix it and make it better improve it one bit at a time until you feel that you are free from suffering and you are completely enlightened